your nose makes nitric oxide so that when you breathe in, when you inhale through your nose, the nitric oxide does several things. One, it relaxes the trachea and the bronchioles. In other words, the airways. The airways have smooth muscle. Nitric oxide relaxes smooth muscles, mm. arteries and airways. So the nitric oxide widens the bronchioles so you can get more air into your lungs. That makes sense. But also when that nitric oxide gets into your lungs, it dilates the pulmonary arteries. So you get mm. more blood flow deep into your lungs to undergo oxygen exchange. And more recently, it was found that that same nitric oxide elicits antimicrobial effects. In other words, nitric oxide is very, very strong in killing bacteria, parasites, and certain viruses. So we, our lungs are exposed to the outside air. Isn't that right? I mean, mm. we're, breathing, we're breathing air. We're taking in germs. We're taking in germs all the time through our nose. So it makes sense that Mother Nature would design the nose to make nitric oxide so it would go into the lungs when we breathe to keep those bugs from dividing, replicating, and causing damage inside the lungs.